Hey guys, this is Hard Gun Games. <coughs> sorry, God, I'm so sorry. And <coughs> I just wanted to um, give you guys a uh, a file. Uh, it's it's a brush that I made for clothing that I hope you'd like. It's how I made the pants um, and the shirt and most of the the wrinkles on the jacket so first I'm gonna show you how to use it by the way if you wanna just go ahead and download it the link is in the description um so I'm just gonna show you how to use it real quick so I'm just gonna load up uh, maybe like a cylinder to to simulate like maybe a pant leg or something like that and make that a poly mesh so the way it works is it basically works off of the pinch um, the pinch, the pinch brush. As you can see, the base type is the print, the pinch brush. Um, and then what it does is it builds up, but it also pinches it at the same time, so it creates like a wrinkle automatically. And this is great for creating, um, for creating indentions as well. You know, you can also use it for maybe scrapes and stuff like that. But if you increase the size of the brush you can see that you can get some nice some nice wrinkles in there and it's gonna have a little bit of a little bit of some artifacting and stuff like that but you can just smoothen that away um and yeah that's pretty much all there is to it uh some different types of wrinkles that i can show you um Basically when you're working with uh, clothing that um, is like pants and stuff like that they get more crinkly down at the the leg part So you just want to kind of zigzag um, And as you can see just by zigzagging makes some pretty nice wrinkles you can even top it off by making some <coughs> Sorry some custom some custom stuff And yeah, you know you can just sit there and go nuts with it <clears throat> not too nuts you don't want to go postal but if you just sit there and kind of just wrinkle like that uh, you don't want to dig into the model because folds happen when all of when when the when the pants are too long so that's like the extra amount of clothing bits so if you dig into it it's gonna look kind of strange that you're digging into it so you just want to kind of build it up um and if you're reaching points where uh it's not doing anything and it's kind of just creating like a little bit of a a wrinkle then just basically go down to your depth mask and bring this up and you can uh <coughs> bring the depth of it up which will which will help the wrinkles build up a lot better see as you can see now the wrinkles are starting to to form a little bit better so you just kind of want to zigzag um, if you're, if you know, the character's wearing pants, um, or you just want to drape if they're wearing, uh, you know, loose shirts. But as you can see, make some really good wrinkles. And you don't really have to do that much. <clears throat> it just basically builds up, pinches it, and you're good to go. Wrinkles. So... The link is down in the description. Uh, if you like this video, please leave a like, comment, um, share, subscribe, and uh, yeah, um, there will be more videos in the future. Thank you. Because, you know, I have no life now. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, have a good day. Bye.